and I was getting ready to write some poetry for a special someone. Here with us on Lessons Learned is our host, Rick Miller, and he's got a comment about poetry that you write from, <laughs> for someone. What is it, Rick? I know you're full of shit when you write the poetry. <laughs> Lessons learned. They know that you're full of shit when you write them poetry. Rick Miller. Psychiatrist, philosopher, medic. I can write poetry if I want to, you sum of a bitch. <laughs> I don't know what to say, man. You go ahead and write your poetry. No, there's deep, dark feelings for them. For her. For her. <laughs> and have her wadded up and throw it in your face. <laughs> You're fucking mean, Miller! Or in this case, she'll just delete it from her damn email. She can't, delete she can't delete poetry like that, man. Shit that was written for her and now for somebody else. Shit that means something. In this crazy mixed up world that... Ah, fuck. I don't even know where we are. We're fucking lost and we got satellite imagery. Some of a bitch. There's, there's a something going on in this world. I don't know what it is, but she makes it all make sense. Short phrases, one line, then the next one indented, then another line, the next one indented. You piece it together and you get some kind of emotion with words. It's crazy. It's feelings that you never felt before. Has it worked so far? What? Has it worked so far? Yeah, it works, man. It's gotta work. It's poetry, man. There's people out there that say, hey, hey you want to get to the soul of somebody, you want to really let them know what's going on, you gotta write a poetry, man. You gotta let them know what you're really feeling. No, it didn't really work that well, but Jesus Christ, man, let me focus. Maybe this is the one. Maybe she'll understand my Thanks, deep man. understanding of life and, and what I really try to see in this this messed up world that we try to piece back together by sending our sons and daughters off to foreign lands to fight in wars. I gotta make sense out of something, man. Sometimes I gotta do that with a line and then the next one indented and then a line and the next one indented. It goes on and on and on until suddenly I feel like, hey, I've expressed myself enough and she'll understand what I'm saying with incomplete sentences. Until she writes you on saying, my dear love, I cannot see you anymore. The next time we see each other, we have to act professional. 100%! <laughs> and so, this is the way of our world. Falling apart slowly, day by day. But as long as you present yourself with enough emotion, people will really think you give a shit. I thank you. The lessons learned.